They already know in advance. They said this is, they know in it, okay, you already get a good idea. Okay, um, watch the fun, okay. Reality, of, for one of the original reality TV was like Miss America. Um, really? But I, I was there, I was watching, you know, at, at a station one night when the, they had the Bird Parks fiasco and they basically wanted to get rid of Bird Parks. And they had the actor they wanted to replace him with give him a, a set of cards. Mm -hmm. And he's, you know, he's reading the cards, but what they didn't know was that Bert Parks didn't need glasses. They thought because he wore glasses, he couldn't, you know, they were, they, they were ba boss. he basically worked, he was one of the original, uh, one of the original music men on Broadway. So he wore glasses for the role. They thought he couldn't see, and he's sitting there reading these things. Uh, and he said, uh, and, they, and the winner is, and he said, no, this is not, the winner here is not the one that is on the, uh, the uh, on this that Mr. So forth and so forth just read off. And he basically walks with the card out towards the camera. Uh -huh. That's when they blew the whistle. And they said, well, the problem was there was an error. But what Mr. Park didn't understand is we reserved the right to decide who the winners are going to be. And we just changed the winner and forgot to notify him on the card. No, they wanted Parks to go, but that blew the thing off. Second thing was um, the Jerry Lewis Telethon, when, um, uh, which was really ultimate reality, which was uh, supposedly uh, um, we have, uh, Robert Conrad came on and they gave him a, ten, they gave him a check for appearing on the show. And he said, I don't want to check. I'm here to do this. They said, no, you're here because you're being paid to be on. I said, well, okay, let's get a check back. No, you're not allowed to do that according to union rules. So in a sense, that was you just blew the whistle on that too. That everybody who's working on the show is getting paid. So uh, well, you know, sometimes I think I think people look at this and they see the Kardashians who are, you know, how should we say, famous for being famous? Yeah. Right. Um, we remember Kim Kardashian when she first came across the carpet, and we re remember that, and we were like, yeah. said, who's that? And people were like, oh, just take a picture. And we're like, well, who is she? You know, because you've got to capture photographs before you do things out. They're like, oh, that's Kim Kardashian. I'm like, yeah, and oh, she goes out to clubs with Paris Hilton. And people are going, yeah. So why are we taking a picture? Yeah, I mean, <laughs> right? well, I mean remember, uh, who's who's Paris Hilton? Who's okay? We were actually at a fashion event, mm -hmm. and the Hiltons came in, and you know, uh, you know, <laughs> who 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 were the who are those girls? They had uh, Paris and Nikki. Mm -hmm. Who who were they? I mean, there was a couple of girls, and then. Uh, you know, that's, that's a famous reality star. Mm -hmm. And then they go to the wrong girl. Because mm -hmm. nobody knew, which they, they didn't know who, okay, if you didn't watch, you know, uh, was it, it was uh, Paris Hilton and Nicole Richie in their first season of being reality stars. Well, part of it is if you don't watch that show, you might not know. No, nobody okay. in the press knew who they were, but they're telling everybody, going down, oh, that's Paris Hilton. She's the reality star. And then you're not talking, where? They say, put us over on this channel. I don't get cable. <laughs> you know, which would be the precedent going down the line. Well, you know, going back on reality shows, I mean, can I, should, I, should I even mention that? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. no, we have to be careful because we do know a lot of people that work on we, reality we, shows. We do. So They're it, really hardworking actors. It's come through the years. I mean, Anna Nicole Smith did a reality TV show. Um, Gene Simmons, everybody knows the family jewels, the Kardashians. Okay, I'd like to tell you folks. Gene Simmons is really a nice guy. Mm -hmm. He really is a nice guy. And as Shannon Tweed is really a nice And they actually, they've got two really good kids. So what you may see is not necessarily what's real. Well, you know, here's kind of the difficulty is you see what's on TV, right? And, yeah. And part of it is they shot it all here at this period of time, yeah. right, for the cameras. Yeah. And then you go through this period of time. And so you've already passed that, but then everybody else sees it. And then they kind of see the results, and they're trying to figure out. I mean, Bachelor and Bachelor Pat are like, are they still together? Yeah, right? I know. But are it, they? I heard Pat Boone one night. Pat Boone was the next door neighbor to Ozzy, you know, Ozzy Osbourne, and he, he was watching that show. And he, I mean, he said he had this, who the, and then basically some words was that. They said that's not Oz. Mm -hmm. He said, where are those? Where did those people? They said that my next door neighbors, they're doing this next door. Mm -hmm. And, and then they, well, of course, Ozzy, but just because he wasn't invited, that's why he was upset. <laughs> no, no, no. He, just, he said that wasn't, he said they didn't film next door. 
Well, see, in part, it's like in the earlier days, these were earlier MTV. Yeah. Remember, MTV used to be known only for doing videos. And then one of their first series was they were all in a house. Oh, get a, that, that, you remember? Yeah, it's all based off of British reality shows, which are all phony as can be. They stock those things with well-known English personalities. So they get a big house and they put all these kids in it, right? Which is all done in a door. Okay, it, okay, the show's on for 22 weeks. Well, the show was filmed in a few days. Mm -hmm. And they basically, okay, folks, uh, let's see, which one of you is 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 Jerry one okay you're gone okay and then look look like you're okay and then about five or six hours okay who is Harold okay Harold uh, you're disappointed at the fact that you've been voted out the vote happened <laughs> I guess I wasn't there when the vote happened. That's, they said that's why they voted you out. Oh, okay. And then a little while later, hey Janice, Janice. And they said, yeah, I know. I'm gone. They said, no. You're surprised by the fact that you got to stay. Oh. Yeah. That, that's, that's, that was reality TV. That was, that was before. That was before. That's when, okay, let's put it this way, it, the first few years of reality TV, nobody knew it was being written. And what happened was, the people got pissed off about the fact that they weren't getting an Emmy nomination, so somebody submitted themselves. Mm -hmm. And then the people who were at the Emmy Awards, uh, that's a script for an episode. Mm -hmm. And they want to know, what do we do? And they said, uh, the rules say if they submit themselves and they wrote it, you have to accept it. So guess what happened, folks? They got their own category at the Emmys for reality TV. Best writing, best directing, best, and uh, how we say, best acting. Uh-huh. And there are some that have, oh, yes, Is it, shall we say Dark at Night? I think it's the Big Brother one that does that. Yeah. So you can actually turn on on one of the other stations and you can watch them in the house Ooh, at night. I, like, I, oh, I see that. Big, bro <laughs> Big Brother after, after. After Dark or what is yeah, it? No, actually, it's on cable. I've never watched that, but I know it's, you know. Okay, they do all of those things that you cannot see on television. Uh -huh. You know, of which basically, as I understand, used to happen on every television show that was ever made between, you know, there'd basically be a lot of going on one another anyway, but but no, it's uh, look at it this way there is no such thing as reality television. There, you know, okay, here is what the reality about reality TV is what that my guess is the same people that put the current administration in power believe reality TV is real. Well, you know, see, part of it is there's a lot of people that do think it's real. Oh, yeah, the, uh, Bill, I'm, Bill, seri I'm uh, being serious. Bill O'Reilly does, mm -hmm. and I think so does Sean Hannity. I mean, Are you uh, serious? Oh yeah, they think that we, I mean, they, get, they condemn it. I think Rush Limbaugh, they, Rush Limbaugh may be a right-wing loony, but Rush Limbaugh does not. He, he knows that all this stuff is faked. He knows, I mean, it's just like, a, 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 I'll give you a bit. Um, I grew up with Roy Rogers and John Wayne and, um, and, and, uh, and Gene Autry driving trucks with Indians chasing after them with telephone poles and airplanes flying mm -hmm. overhead. Um, and nobody noticed the difference. Well, you know, here's part of it is when people watch this, okay, duh, okay, here, here's the part that you think about, is if you're watching the reality TV and, oh, yeah, he runs after it and then goes off the show, and then right before he runs after and goes off the show, which is supposedly real time, yeah. right? They break away to him just casually talking, well, you know, I wasn't quite certain about this. And it's like, wait a minute, if he was going through all that, that happened afterwards. And yeah. then they taped it. They taped it. Yeah. But, uh, the uh, example of non-reality reality TV is on the military channel. You'll hear major stars, mm -hmm. you, know, uh, uh, you know, I mean, like a Michael Caine. You know, I can remember when it, what it was like. Michael Caine was not there. He's, he was free of folks. But he's, I remember what it was like, I'd walk through the, you know, as I was walking up the beach of at Anzio and all that, and uh, people buy into the fact that he's one of them. What? No, John Connery was, John Connery was about this big during that time period too, so. No, but uh, it, the, the, the reality TV is not reality. It's only reality if it is done, okay, um, okay, what is reality? That computer is closed. 
we work with no scripts, period. We might, oh, we might have reality, a reference. It's like faction. It's faction. You go, what? It's fact or fiction. Fact faction. or fiction. It is a faction that reality TV is real. It cannot be reality and have written material. It cannot be. I know. See, that's the part. We do reality on a daily Isn't basis. You see everything. Okay, I mean, okay, we'll, we'll show you reality. You step back from the camera. Look at her left leg. That's reality. You want to make it unreality? Okay, that is gone. That, so that, that we're, we're filming around it. We're filming around it, but that's reality TV. And a reality, anything, it happens then and there. It is, um, okay, uh, what is news? Mm -hmm. News is what is happening now. What is history? What has happened. Is what has happened. It is why we are yesterday, today, and tomorrow, because we are here. Everything that we do, is, we do know, we do, we actually do live, do live news every now and then. But mostly what we do is, is back here. Mm -hmm. When you see this, that is news when we're doing it. Right now, this is the day of the death of the gentleman, Mr. Uh, Rus Mr. Russell. Russell Armstrong. But when you see it, it will be history. Mm -hmm. If you see a reality show, it is history. It is not reality. Well, you know, and part of it is the people that are on the show since the episodes haven't been seen, they have to keep up appearances. Yeah. Right? It's just the same thing. Uh, okay. An example would be, they like, they film a show six months in advance, and the day after the show is dumped off a of Survivor Island, the person that dumped off a of Survivor Island shows up on the Letterman show. Yeah! How does that happen? And he, 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 he'll, he'll, sometimes Boy. they'll come in. Okay, and they were on the other side of the world. Yeah, they're on the other side of the world. And, um, and they'll come in just as disheveled as they were when they were on the show. And they well, the instant they leave the island, they're flown immediately out. And they're flying directly to the Letterman show. Of course, that could have been half a year ago, which means what it is is they're, you know, they're getting the make, you know, like this, getting the hair all done, getting the face dirty, you know, coming on, and you know. Well, you know. here's the challenge with this show: is Russell Armstrong has passed away. Yeah. And they got the show in the can, and. And, and he's and basically they're blaming they have the a show. Season. <laughs> 